Is there any planet that look like Earth? Are they habitable? Is there life in other Earth-like planets? What does scientists discovered till today? And where are these planets that may looks like our home? In this video we will look to five exoplanets that are listed by scientists as Earth-like planets, with atmospheric condition, mass, density, liquid water, and even with an unknown amount of percentage that there may also be life out there. So first and most of all, where could be the place for another life in our galaxy, another galaxy, or anywhere in the universe? Let's find out what scientists discovered so far in the space about planets that looks like Earth. According to scientists, planets that look like Earth are often found at a distance from a star that is called habitable zone. So, before we dive into the planets and since this term is going to be familiar across our entire journey, let's take a quick reminding of what habitable zone means. According to scientists, habitable zone refers to the distance of a planet from a star at which liquid water could exist on the surface of the planet orbiting. This means the planet's distance is not very far so that it will not be a freezing ice-cold world or it is not very much closer to its star so that it is not too hot with a burning atmosphere that would melt down everything with extreme heat. Having this in mind let's look at the planets that look like Earth. Among the number of Earth-like planets discovered by scientists, here are five of them and let's begin with a planet named TOI 700d. TOI 700d. This is an exoplanet found in a solar system called TOI 700. TOI 700 is a small, cool M dwarf star located around 100 light years from our solar system. And, the amazing part, begins from the fact that the planet TOI 700d is found in a habitable zone of distance from its star. So, due to its favorable distance from its star, TOI 700d is not a burning planet or freezing ice world with a temperature that is neither too hot nor too cold. Not only this, scientists also predicted that there is liquid water in the planet. Can you imagine that? Water in this planet? Well, as you know for any kinds of life to exist on our Earth it's because of liquid water. From the smallest cyanobacteria to the biggest wheel and of course including humans, all needs water to exist and all exists because there is water since the beginning of life. So, is the condition in planet TOI 700d is like Earth with water that contributes for the existence of life? What if there is life in this planet and what kind of life is out there? While well, this needs further scientific study and beside to its Earth-like characters what we know so far about this planet is that TOI 700d is 20% larger than Earth and it finished orbiting its star with 37 days. The planet also has surface area with rocky mountains and solid ground just like Earth. TRAPPIST LE This planet is found in a solar system that is located 40 light year away from ours. It's another Earth-like planet with favorable distance from its sun for liquid water to exist. That is because TRAPPIST LE is found in habitable zone in the solar system. The planet is 8% less dense than Earth. Scientists have confirmed that within the solar system that is found on this planet there are also seven Earth-sized planets. Among these planets three of them are found in the habitable zone of the solar system. Furthermore, studies also shows that including TRAPPIST LE, all these three planets are predicted to have liquid water and solid surface areas. Kiplo 186 This is a planet that is considered as sister of Earth by scientists due to its similarities within a number of way. The first one is its size. Kiplo 186 is the first planet discovered by scientists with similar size like Earth. This planet is located 500 light years from Earth and it is found in a habitable zone of another solar system which astronomically means there is liquid water. This show the second similarity. Kiplo 186 distance from its star is in a location that is not too close or not too far from its star so that the it may not be an absolute cold freezing planet or not too hot and burning. In addition to this, the data gathered from the different light rays and telescope images implies that this planet has a solid surface area, rocky mountains and a vast ocean. If this is going to be proved with more scientific discoveries, well there you have another Earth, with a much satisfactory ground to say another life too. Kepler 452b 
This is an exoplanet that looks like Earth. Kepler 452b orbit a G2 type star of about the same temperature like our Sun, however, the star hosting Kepler 452b is 6 billion years old, which means it's 1.5 billion years older than our Sun. The planet Kepler 452b looks like Earth with a habitable nature that contains water, rocks and mountains. This planet is bigger, with 60% larger than Earth, but its distance from its star is in a habitable zone where liquid water could be found due to the position of the planet relative to its star. The last one is Proxima Centauri b. Of all the planets we have seen so far, this is the nearest Earth-like planet, our nearest similar neighbor that is found in a habitable zone of a solar system. Proxima Centauri b is found only four light years from Earth and it's the closest Earth-like planet. The mass of this exoplanet is 1.27 times to Earth. It orbits its star far more closely than Mercury orbits our Sun, taking only 11 days to complete a single orbit. It is found in a habitable zone of distance from its star Proxima Century. Since this planet is found in the habitable zone and based on the data gathered by scientists, the existence of liquid water is very high. With that the existence of life too. By the way beside to water, the type of stars is also determining factor for life to exist according to astrobiology studies. According to the science our Sun is a G-type star. However, most of those Earth-sized worlds are detected orbiting red dwarf stars, so far it is rare to find Earth-like and Earth-sized planets in wide orbits around Sun-like stars. So, these red dwarf stars have a huge potential of deadly impact on a planet that is near around. And these could smash out almost all the hope for a possible life in another planet beside to Earth. Till our scientific studies with new outstanding technologies discover further information let's stop our journey here and please don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy the trip. Thank you for watching.